a project that I'm collaborating with a musician and an artist. It's called Dance Room Spectroscopy. The idea is to uh, use physics, mix classical quantum mechanics, and then what we do is we uh, we basically let people walk through the force field. People, well, as people walk through a room, they warp the force field and the particles field. So the particles dynamically respond to their motion, and then uh, when the particles collide with each other or with the walls, they generate notes. So people can generate their own crowds, and people can generate their own dynamic soundscapes and visualscapes. Ultimately, the idea is to put it in venues where Lee could drop bass lines and all sorts of other effects that, as and when he pleases. And then dynamically, have a dynamic feedback loop with the crowd, where he modulates the crowd and the crowd sends feedback back to him. So it's to create a sort of digital feedback loop. And so Lee has a lot of experience doing, working with choreographed dancers and things like this. So uh, the goal is to try to create some sort of, instead of looking down at the computer and looking up all the time, some sort of closed digital feedback loop where we can source out the vibe of what a group of people or individuals are doing. The age range that people have come in and just looked up and start smiling. Moving around as well, you know? Old grandmas moving around. Little kids moving around saying it's a party in here. Uh, it's, been pretty, it's been good to see people uh, like it. And I think the physics aspect of things also makes it interesting to people. We've done a lot of evaluating like how are we going to communicate things. But I think the exercise itself is useful because I think interacting and explaining spawns new ideas and ways to approach. And like some of the mechanism, we're developing some new ways of interpreting really chaotic data. So this is very much a research project. And that's one of the things I really like about this is there's a feedback directly into my research, data research, with the kind of stuff we're doing here. And, but it also looks cool. 